Hello everybody, how are you doing today? My name is Horizontal and this is episode 190 of the world famous University Love Podcast, also known as Online Marketing Moves. We're going to come to you live today. Today is Monday, February the 1st, 2021, at the time of this recording. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a, we have a big announcement. Today, <clears throat> moving forward, if you want to email the show, you want to get in contact with me, you can email me at Tony at OnlineMarketingMoves.com. Once again, that is Tony at OnlineMarketingMoves.com. Email me. You know, let me know what you think about the show. Let me know what kind of business you're in. Let's get to know each other. Chit chat, communicate. So email me once again at Tony at OnlineMarketingMoves.com. And don't worry if you didn't if you didn't hear it on this episode, you will hear that email address on every episode. So stay tuned but today ladies and gentlemen we are going to talk about putting your content behind a paid wall when you start to get you know very popular and you get more and more subscribers now i bring this up because the discovery network they decided to have an app a lot of people have apps these days but they decided to have a app just the the discovery network they have all kinds of different TV shows or different TV channels. But one of the most popular shows is called 90 Day Fiance. And they have taken that and they've spun it off to they have, I don't know, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten shows. I don't they have a lot of shows, so they have a lot of content. So they decided to take a lot of their content off of the free off of the free, you know, quote unquote cable because a lot of people don't watch cable anymore. A lot of people have cut the cord on cable. They watch TV from Hulu or YouTube or what, wherever. So they they took a lot of the old content off and they decided, hey, if you want to see this old content, pay the four ninety nine for the app. And a lot of people are upset because they don't want to pay. They want to they want to just turn on the phone, you know, turn on the TV and watch for free all this. This old stuff from five, six years ago. And a lot of people are complaining. They say, hey, we helped build the show. But at the end of the day, the Discovery Network is a for-profit business. And you and I are in the for-profit business. So if you ever get up to, you know, say you get 200 videos, 300 videos. And you you have, you know, 50,000, 100,000 subscribers. And you think, should I go to Patreon and... You know, take off my old videos from YouTube and then upload them to Patreon. And people say pay a certain amount. Of course, you should, because one, <clears throat> the beautiful thing about if you have a somebody subscribes to you know somebody say if you have a Patreon account or you have an app where you can upload videos and somebody pays every month. The best thing about that is recurring income on a monthly basis. You know. You don't have to, the best kind of business is repeat business. So why not? You say, hey, if you enjoy this content, you know, come back, check out old episodes, check out new episodes behind the paywalls. Nothing wrong with that. I know a lot of people was upset with the Discovery Network, but we are in America. We are in a business, you know, people are running a business. So why not take advantage of a popular why not take advantage of your popularity? You know, everything doesn't have to be paid for, but at the same time, you are in the business. To, you are in, you are doing this to make money. So you have to think, you know, you have to think like a business person. Everything can't be free. I know a lot of people want everything free. Give me your notebook. Give me your, you know, PDFs free. Give me courses free. Free, 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 free. You know, no. If you have, like I have 190 episodes, eventually I'm going to take the, <laughs> one of these days, I'm going to take all these episodes off. Not all of them, but a good portion of them. I'll take them off and i say, hey, if you want to hear old episodes, you want to be inspired, you know, you can pay some money uh, on either an app or some kind of service where, you know, I can just upload videos on a weekly basis. You know, I listen to this wrestling podcast. They do the same thing. They have a, it's like five dollars a month on Patreon. You can pay five dollars every month, and they upload old videos from ten years ago for old episodes. And people are like, oh, 
I want to listen to this episode 10 years ago. You had so-and-so on as a guest, you know, things of that nature. And people like it. So don't be a, don't be, don't get into the fear of charging people money for, for your product. All right. Some people, some people will, some people will complain, moan and groan, but the majority of people, if they follow you, if they are following you already, they will keep following you and they will be willing to pay. So, you know, I mean, for me, Discovery Network is genius because they've taken advantage of the show and now they have new episodes that you can only find on the app. So it's like they are, you know, going above and beyond, you know, what they, for the four ninety nine, you're going to get value in the four ninety nine. So it's a smart play by them and it should be a smart play by you. So take advantage after a while, you know, you build up enough content, take advantage and make sure that you are getting paid for some of this content. You know, I know everybody wants you to upload all your videos on YouTube all the time, but YouTube is a search engine. Don't get me wrong, but sometimes YouTube doesn't want to, sometimes YouTube doesn't want to pay you what you're worth. So sometimes you have to, figure out how can I get, you know, the right amount of money every on a monthly basis. So just think about that. When whenever you whenever you start to take off with, you know, you get, you know, one thousand, two thousand, three thousand, hundred thousand subscribers, hundred thousand followers, you know, just start thinking about how can I monetize the situation. All right. With that being said, that's it. That's it for the podcast today. My name is Tony Zano. Hope you enjoyed this episode. Keep the business hat on, everybody, okay? That being said, we will talk to you tomorrow. And as always, everybody, peace.